Hi, my name is Tempi. I am a thermometer. People use me to measure the temperature or how warm or cold something is. Thermometers come in different shapes and sizes. I have a glass tube with a bulb at the bottom that holds a colored liquid inside. This liquid will get smaller when it is cool and get bigger when it gets warmer. Temperature is measured in degrees. This little symbol, O, means degrees. There are little lines across the side of my tube that measure the degrees of temperature as a number. The higher the number is, the warmer the temperature. I can read temperatures between 0 and 100 degrees. Which temperature is warmer? 30 degrees or 50 degrees? Click on your answer. 50 degrees. That's right. Good job. This is what a thermometer might look like in the winter. Do you think that it is warm or cold outside? Pick the clothing that you should wear when the temperature looks like this. Hat. Gloves. That's right. You will need these to stay warm today. Not all thermometers look like me. Thermometers come in different shapes and can measure different temperatures. Next, I'll show you a few of my friends and how they work. Thermometers can be found in lots of places. They are in refrigerators so that we can select the right temperature to store our food. Those thermometers measure cooler temperatures. Stoves or furnitures have thermometers so that we can select the right temperature to heat our homes. They measure warmer temperatures than refrigerators. Let's see if you can match the thermometers to the right pictures. Good job! Thermometers can be placed outside so that farmers can protect their crops and animals. Farmer Frank will want to know when to expect frost, so that plants can be covered to protect them. It looks like it is going to be cold tonight. Click on the thermometer to see what happens. Good job. You protected the crops by covering them. In the summer the temperature is very warm. Farmer Frank will need to provide shade and plenty of water for the animals. Click on thermometer to see where he moves his animals today. Yes, that will help to keep the animals cooler. Mechanics like Mike and car owners watch the temperature of the engine to prevent it from overheating. If an engine gets too hot, it won't run. This is Robbie, the race car. Watch what happens when his temperature changes. Robbie's engine purrs initially when needle is in blue and normal zones. As temperature gets into red zone, it begins to sputter or cough. The engine rattles and stops when needle reaches top of red zone. A parent, doctor or nurse may check your temperature when you are sick. That is what Nan the nurse is doing. When the body gets hot it is called a fever. Look at the two thermometers and click on the one that is warmer. Yes, good job. That's the warmer temperature. Benny the baker needs to pick the right temperature for his oven to bake the bread so that he can sell it. Click on the temperatures and see what happens. Let's see how much you have learned about thermometers. Which of these temperatures is the warmest? That's right. Good job. Click on the picture of each person who uses a thermometer to do their work. Yes, that's right. Who else? Yes, that's right. Yes. That's right.
Good job. Match the thermometer with the picture. Yes, that's right. Well, it's time to say goodbye. Hope you have learned a few things about thermometers today. Thanks for letting me show how my friends and I help with everyday jobs. Thank you.